remember when I lied and said that I wasn't doing any more Supreme videos for a while? That's what happens when there's a sale. And they try to get rid of all the crap people didn't want. And then I see something that's not actually that bad and the sale price is actually pretty good. And so I end up buying it and now I have more Supreme stuff to go over. You already know the vibes. Supreme bag. Uh, I already I wore this shirt today actually. Um was another t-shirt. I know I don't need any more t-shirts, but too late now I already bought it and wore it, so um it is uh it's getting um, this have what does this have on this? Oh, okay. Um yeah, so Supreme had their little end of year, end of season sale where they basically they make a couple things cheaper. Um, basically, it's usually stuff people didn't care for or didn't want. And so they just make it like $40 cheaper so people will buy it so they don't have to keep it for next season or something. Um, there wasn't a lot of stuff that I liked per se, but there was one thing I saw that I liked. Um, I tried to get the pink colorway of it before I could check out. It sold out, unfortunately. I was like, really? I can't even cop on freaking sale days. So I ended up getting... A different color of it. I'm happy with the color I did get because I don't really have that many shirts in the color that it is. I have, I mean, those, I don't wear this shirt out. I don't really have any blue shirts per se that I wear out a lot. Um, so yeah, it is a, it is a blue shirt. Um, it is the, look at you guys can see that. It's the Contrast Stitch Pocket Tee. Uh, size large. It is in the, it says LT Royal. I don't know if that means light royal. It's not light. I can tell you that much. Um, it's a royal blue t-shirt. It's nice. Um, yeah, this is it. This is the pocket stitch tee I got, or stitch pocket tee or whatever. Um, just a simple little t-shirt. Um, the reason it's a stitch pocket tee or whatever, I don't know if you can see that. There's a lot of like details of where it's like, you can see the stitching um, right here on the sleeves, um, on the pocket. Um, and obviously it's a pocket tee, so there is a pocket right here. In case you wanna put something in there. Um, just a simple little t-shirt. The only reason I didn't buy it the first time it came out is because these things, like, retailed for, like, 70 bucks. Um, which is a little expensive for me. I mean, it's a t-shirt. It's one of those they consider, like, tops or whatever, so they're, they're more expensive, um, than the normal t-shirt, like, the graphic tees are. So that's why I kind of passed on it. It was on sale, though. I got it for, I think it was, like, 44 with the sale price. I got it and I got it was like 50, 55, 56 after taxes and shipping and stuff. So I got that, you know, what would probably usually be like an $80 t-shirt for 55. I was like, I'll take that. I'll take the $30 in savings. That's not too bad. Um, wore it. It's really soft. It, you know, it's like I said, it's, I don't know if I'd call it low key per se, but it's not like, obviously it's not like a box logo like that back there. I mean, it's just got Supreme down the side. That's like the only thing on it that says any kind of branding is just the pocket. So if somebody's looking at the back view, it's just a blue t-shirt. Um, it is it is soft though, I will give it that. I will give it that, it is, it is really soft quality fabric. Um, it's 100% it's cotton, as you can see right there, size large, fits, fits really well. Um, like I said, I rocked this with uh, some um, some tan joggers and a pair of shoes. I'm gonna show you guys in a little bit. I'll give you actually, I'll give you guys a little bit of a sneak peek actually of what I have or what I grabbed the other day. You have to stay tuned for that video though. It's coming soon. Um, it was a nice outfit. Definitely something I would consider myself wearing. Um, I mean, not just not just during the summer. It could be a good like fall T-shirt. Like, you know what I mean? Just having like wearing like a jacket over it because it's, you know, it's just a plain t-shirt. Didn't want to pass it up. Can never have no too many Supreme shirts down the line. If I need to sell it, I can sell it and whatnot. Um, just wanted to grab it because it was, I did enjoy, I did like it. Uh, the pink one is the one I wanted. Like I said, I had it in my cart and then it just sold out. I was like, are you kidding me? I like the, no, the, the Royal one because like I said, I have like zero. Let me look. I have like two blue shirts maybe other than this then like i said this is just like a something i wear here in the house um so definitely happy to grab another blue shirt and add it to my supreme collection um that's pretty much it for today's video it's gonna be a really short one uh, i just wanted to kind of show you guys the last thing i got from the supreme spring summer 20 i promise this is the last supreme spring summer 20 video um they're they've closed the shop now they're getting they're preparing for um next season fall winter 
Um, I did get stickers. I got two box logos. These are actually in really good condition. I know that's stupid, but like half the ones I've been getting this season have been like bent to crap. These are like literally like flawless, like perfectly straight, everything. I was surprised. And then uh, I did get something. I don't think I don't think I got this in other yeah, the sticker packs. Um, the um, what they call this, like the social security card or whatever. Just says Supreme USA 94 to 2020. Never mind the effing BS, politics as usual, and then signatures out of order. And then it just kind of says, uh, Divided States of America, blood, sweat, and tears are kind of around the corners. Um, pretty cool. I like it. Um, just a nice little sticker. Like I said, I don't think I got this one in the sticker pack I got when I ordered the spring summer tees. I think I just got, um, the marble and the, uh, the motion logo. So I'm glad to at least have gotten this too. So I have had this in my collection. These will be added to the ever-growing stack of box logos. Um, this stack will start diminishing slowly, um, or at least not gather as many compatriots because I am slowing down on my buying from Supreme, in theory. Obviously, if, if fall, winter 20 is a flame season, it's a flame season. If I grab a bunch of stuff, I grab a bunch of stuff. But like I was telling my friends, it's to the point where I am no longer just gonna buy random crap like the umbrella, I paid like 70 bucks for it. It's going for like 67 on StockX. So it, it was not worth it. And I don't, I don't use umbrellas that much. Um, obviously, I'm, <laughs> if it doesn't go up in price, I'm going to try to use it to make at least somewhat of a, a use out of it. That way I don't pay $70 for a freaking umbrella. It's just going to sit here. But, you know, sometimes you make dumb purchases. That's just how it goes. Um, but that is it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, go and drop a like on it. I would appreciate it. Make me feel pretty good about putting out this content. I promise Supreme will start slowing down for at least a little bit. You'll start getting some other videos like shoes and other things that I've bought recently. Um, if you comment, did you cop anything from the sale that they had at the end of Supreme summer, Spring Summer 2020? Um, what was your favorite item from Supreme Spring Summer 2020? Go and let me know in the comment section below. I do read those and I do uh, reply to them. And uh, subscribe if you haven't already to stay up to date on everything I do uploaded. Like I said, you're going to see that uh, Yeezy um, 700 V3 Alva video should be coming out pretty quickly. Um, I think the Jonah Hills already came out, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I do have, I'm going to have like a A24 unboxing. It's going to be something I bought a couple days ago and something that's coming in this week. Uh, there's a hoodie that's coming in that I'm going to have. I think that's it for now, at least. I know it sounds awful, but um, I'm sure here soon. I need to do, I want to do an updated shoe collection video too. So that'll probably be coming out here in the next couple weeks if I had to guess. Because I've got quite a bit more than I did. Or well, I wouldn't say quite a bit more per se. I would just say there's two, there's definitely two different sections now. There's the everyday shoes I have and then there's the hype shoes that I have. So there's definitely going to be. A difference between 2018s and 2020s but like i said that'll come eventually for now i will just end this video um hope you guys are doing okay social distancing all that crap wearing your masks it is now mandated in indiana by the time this video comes out it will be mandated um so you have to no matter where you're at wear a mask let's uh let's not keep going backwards guys let's start moving forwards let's start you know being safe let's start being able to go back out and do stuff um, cause I would like to go to like a sneaker con at some point in my lifetime, but if this keeps happening, we can't do that, can we? Anywho, thanks for watching guys. I really do appreciate it. And until next time, <laughs> peace out.